Okay, so here's a follow-up to the Semka video. I actually received new information from Tommy Wiley that I wanted to also cover in the video. I have the movement off here because um, the only way to actually regulate the movement is to take off, take it off because for some reason when the clock shop redid this, uh, they didn't get that, um, they didn't get this regulator thing on the back of the panel correct. So there's the escapement and there you can see a jewel right there. Uh, this is being really, really touchy with wanting to keep time. It, it's hovering back and forth between going way too fast and way too slow between the fourth dot there. Or not dot, but dash. And there's some markings, if I can just get the camera correct, the W400. Uh, the new information that I heard from Tommy is that this is apparently a Mauta. Uh, and there's the little bell that it strikes on right here. Uh, let me go ahead and demonstrate it for you. I'm going to try and get a view of this without getting in the way too much, but it's just so small, I, whoops, I think I pushed it backwards, yep, I'm gonna try and do this without getting in the way, there's some text there, I can't read it very well, Oh, there you can just make it out. It says Semka Clock Company, made in Germany. Oh, and then there's some markings there for Jewel. Yeah. And there's a, I think this is a serial number. Not quite sure. So now, and the back plate has been reassembled. That was horrible cutting on my part, but I'm not going to edit it out because I don't care. Nonetheless, it's also been retimed. I should also mention something I forgot to uh, say earlier was apparently Semka must have been some kind of like retailing brand for this clock. I actually did end up digging through some Google images and found a clock with the exact same case, but instead of having the four numerals here, it, they were just all dashes, and it had Mauta in the middle. So that kind of further proves what Tommy was saying about this, uh, that these are actually Mautas, and this company, Semka, whatever, must have just also been retailing them. But yeah, now you've gotten to see the movement. And uh, this thing is just has just been horrible trying to time it. But... I think I finally got it. So, I guess time will tell.